WPS stands for Wi-Fi Protected Setup. And as you can see on your screen, these are some of the common symbols of the WPS button that you can find on your Wi-Fi router or other Wi-Fi devices. Now talking about Wi-Fi router, you can mostly find the WPS button on it at the back. Some router models also do have WPS on the front or on the side too. As you can see the images on the screen, this is what different WPS button looks like. So now let's see why we have this WPS button or what's the usage of this WPS button in the router. So suppose you want to connect your phone to your router's Wi-Fi. Then normally you will need to go to the Wi-Fi list on your phone and select the router's Wi-Fi and type its password to get connected to it. But with WPS, you do not have to select the network or type any password. As the word Wi-Fi protected setup explains, you can connect to your router wirelessly without entering the password. So what you need to do is just press the WPS button on the router and then initiate the WPS process from your cell phone Wi-Fi settings. And it will hardly take 30 seconds for the cell phone to get connected to the router. In the same way, you can set up a Wi-Fi extender with your router using a WPS setup. The video is given in the description if you want to learn how to do it. Lastly, if you found this video useful, then please do hit like and subscribe to support my efforts. Thank you so much.